In this video, I'd like to talk about the Write Content tab in Keyword Researcher. The Write Content tab works in conjunction with the middle article tree and allows you to create articles and associate content with it. So you notice here that this content here is associated with the article entitled Best Low Carb Snacks When You're on a Diet, and this is the currently selected article here in our middle article tree. And moreover, the creator of this article is targeting all of these keywords. And of course, one of the primary goals of on-page SEO is to make sure that our keywords are reflected in our article content. And that's why Keyword Researcher is so useful because we can see the words that exist in our content are colored in green, and the words that do not exist in our content are colored in black. And I can visualize these words by clicking on the highlighter icon. And Keyword Researcher will color the words that are reflected in this keyword phrase, low carb desserts. You'll notice that the word desserts is not colored because the word desserts does not appear in our content. So we can see that 14,800 people per month are searching for low carb desserts. So if we wanted to target this keyword, in our article content, then it would be important to add all three of these words from our keyword phrase somewhere in our article content. Now, having said that, you'll notice that there are four pieces of article content. There is the title, the slug, the meta description, and the article content itself. Now, the meta description is not considered part of the content because the meta description is not typically considered to have any SEO value. Rather, the areas of your article where you want keywords to be is in the title, the slug, and the content. But the meta description is mostly just for article promotion and is not related to SEO. So you'll notice that each keyword phrase has the letters T, S, and C directly to the right of the keyword. And again, these stand for the title, the slug, and the content. And if you forget, in white text here, we have a T, an S, and a C, just to remind you that this is, again, the title, the meta description, and the content. These are generally considered to be the primary areas where you'd want to use keywords in your content when doing SEO. And as you click on one of these icons, you'll notice that a little help key will pop up telling you what the colors mean. So in our case of best low carb stacks, we can see the T is green, and that means that the entire keyword phrase exists in our title, which we can see by clicking the highlighter, best low carb snacks. We'll notice that the entire keyword phrase also appears in the slug, which is why the S is green here. And you notice that only portions of the keyword phrase appear in our article content, which is why the C stands for content is colored orange here. Now, this was just a brief introduction to the content tab. There are other help videos at the help page for Keyword Researcher, which of course you can always get to by clicking on the instruction manual button here.